Now, as that debt gets to be more and more owned by the rest of the world because of the of the trade deficit, you know, it 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 can cause problems down the line. Uh, but if you if you ask me whether I'd rather cure one or the other, uh, I would I would rather largely cure the trade deficit. Do you accept the argument that countries like China are locked into this dance with us yeah. because they need our market, so they're unlikely to dump American securities? Oh yeah. They, they, and isn't if they want to sell American securities, if they sell them to somebody in the United States, they get dollars with them. So they have to buy some, something else with the dollars. If they sell them to the French, the French now have them, you know, and, yeah. and, and the, the Chinese have got a claim on, on France. But they can't get, really get rid of them. They can, they can change their asset preference about the American assets they own. But China can't get rid of American assets, basically, or the rest of the world can't unless we start – uh, exporting as much to them as, as, as we're importing. And that day is not going to, it's coming. But it's there are coming. people who will suggest that there may be some catastrophic day. And, and we had that little tremor from the South Koreans about a year ago. There could be a catastrophic day. I don't know the answer to that. I mean, I, uh, but anytime you have huge imbalances in the world and you have lots of people on hair triggers trading currencies and stock and bonds, you have the potential for catastrophic days. Mm. Back to the fiscal deficit and your sense of where we are. 